Hey everyone, Rachel Conga back with uh, Tyler Dare 2 dude. Hello, how are you? We've been trying to record this for like an hour now because of bullshit, but anyway, uh. So, uh. What's that? Okay. I left like. For this. Because, like, I. The thing about this game is that when you go for 100% completion, the silver medals, you'll get like. Like, if you just plow through all the levels after you complete the any percent ending, it'll, uh, you know, you'll get the silver medal and it'll automatically take you to the silver ending. And then you go back into the game and get a right. gold medal. So I figured, fuck it, let's do a few of these, like, with just the silver medal and then come back for them at the end. Because I figured I would make more coherent sense for Let's Play. Yeah, fair, fair. That was a lot of tokens. Uh, Extra try tokens, not lives, but you know. It just seems so weird to see that as uh, with Soli. Yeah. Uh, so I have nothing planned for this whatsoever. Um. Uh. You always pick, like, the worst favorite character you can pick. You pick Knuckles, you pick Krillin, you pick... What? What did I do? Uh, I was just bragging on you for your opinions. Oh, okay. No, I didn't hear you for a while there. No, I, I said you always pick, like, the worst, like, favorite character to have. And I eh. was talking about Krillin and... Well, not Mike, because I, I haven't seen the movie in years, and he's probably, like, a fine character, but, you know, like, Ugh. like, you're always rooting for the underdog, I guess. Yeah, I do tend to do that. I don't entirely know why, but I do tend to do that. Uh, here we are at the Arctic Training Grounds again. Um, I don't know why I couldn't decide what to do here. Uh. What should we talk about during these last two parts? How about snow? I got like three feet of snow outside right now. Yeah, that's that's not good. Yeah, no, it wasn't. Like they, they said it was supposed to be like eight inches to eighteen inches or something like that. And then it was like three feet. Boy, weather sure is weird in New York, eh? Yeah. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh I guess this is a nerve I forgot to scare earlier, like, when I was doing the any percent, whatever, um, I, I was gonna make a joke, like, it was from, and I, I gotta be careful when I say this, cause like, it was like, you gotta understand it was a different period on the internet, but, Pokemon, but with animals instead, he was like, boy, Japanese games sure are weird, huh, Professor, and Professor Oak's like, you should see their porn. <laughs> Those videos uh, were, like, the only good, like, Pokemon is cockfighting for kids videos. Because, like, I've seen several and, like... Oh, uh, I forgot about Star Bomb. Star Bomb had, like... Uh, your mileage would probably vary, but, like, I think it's a lot better because he... he it's not that Pokemon fighting is abuse. It's that he turns to abusing his Pokemon because he's just so good at it or whatever. Yeah, yeah, Ash, Ash turns to, to that. Domestic and then abuse. Pikachu uh, shoots him in the dick. I want to say that, like, one time we were watching this movie in school. I don't know why the fuck we were watching this movie in school because it was, like, PG-13. It was pretty hardcore for a 13. Anyway, we were watching it, and at one point the guy gets shot in the dick. It's called The Duplex, and I'm like, gosh, why are we watching this? This is awful. You're left to dwell on it way too long, like, you know, it supposed to be like he gets shot in the dick and he moves on you're not supposed to focus on that too long like like, like we're doing right now yeah exactly oh fuck i lost two hits for that gotta, one gotta focus on those wait no. uh have we ever talked about fucking uh i'm trying to think of a topic here Have you ever seen Pokemon the Movie 3? 
Tyler, are you there? <laughs> Tyler? Okay, okay. Are, are you there? I, I hear you. Okay, okay. I, I was scared there for a minute because I couldn't hear you. Ah, yeah, yeah. Have I you ever hear seen you. Pokemon yeah. the movie 3? Um, I have. Wait, have I? I believe I have. It was it's the one with Entei. It was the one with Entei. Right, I know what happens in it, I, I, but if I have seen it, it's been a long time. Well, I was just going to say, that movie's kind of weird because it doesn't make that much sense. I don't know if it's the dub or not, but, like, I find it confusing to no, deal it's... with. Ash Ketchum's mom, it's, like, really confusing. Like, is she brainwashed? Is she not brainwashed? Is she brainwashed yeah. part of it? Yeah, no, that I, I do know that it's not the dub. It's actually the dub is one of the most faithful of the Pokemon dubs, or the early Pokemon dubs. It's actually pretty. In fact, it actually kind of fixes a couple of plot plot holes that the uh, original left. That's not being faithful. If you're well, faithful, you should keep the plot holes. Uh, I said more faithful. <laughs> Just kidding around. Uh, uh, exactly. Um, but uh, it, it's weird. I watched it like a, within the last week or something. It's a weird movie. Indeed. It gets really weird when like. She wants to be a Pokemon trainer. She's like, I'm too young. And then she turns into an adult version of herself. And it's like, whoops. Oh, man. Yeah, that is... Oh, man, I forgot about that. That's weird. Beating oh, the internet man. to their little game, just like Rick and Morty. And then that was one of the changes they did, was uh, Brock's reaction to that. Oh, thank fuck. They changed that pretty dope. Y yeah, Bro Brock's That would have been reaction. fucking scary. That was, uh, yeah. I mean, to be fair, I think in the anime, Brock is, like, 15, so. Yeah, I've never understood how old Brock is supposed to be, like. Is he, like, 13? I, 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 it, okay, Team Rocket is 15. Okay. In the anime, at least in the in Japan, like, in the anime. That's why I'm, that's supposed to be 15. They're, they, uh, because Ash, Ash is 10, Team Rocket's supposed to be 15. Uh, and I think... Brock is either 15 or is a little younger than Team Rocket, but obviously older than Ash and Misty. Okay, but uh, I have a qu I have a comment that I wanted to add somewhere there. Uh, yeah, yeah. Fuck, I don't remember what it was. Now it was something like it was it was about it was something related to that. Like, oh, I don't remember. Go ahead and continue what you were gonna tell me. I mean, that was pretty much what I was going to say. It's oh, okay. That, that, that was the ages. Oh, yeah, it was that uh, I saw this clip the other day of Pokemon where, like, uh, Jesse and James meet Butch and Cassidy, and, of course, in the dub, at least, uh, Butch, everyone gets Butch's name wrong. But anyway, uh, they, they argue over... The, they, they argue over... Yeah, Butch Cassidy. Uh, they argue over, like... The, the 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 words to the motto the Team Rocket motto and it seems like Jesse and James are like under the impression of Team Rocket are the good guys. It's kind of inconsistent with a lot of the rest of the dub because usually they're like yeah it's, it's weird. You know if, if you listen to the motto's like words in the in the uh, dub it's like it seems like maybe they don't understand what they're doing. Are you there, Tyler? Tyler, are you there? Tyler! Well, I've lost him. I'm gonna have to fucking... Oh, boy. I might just have to... Go post. Alright, there we go. It fixed itself. It fixed itself. Okay, you're back. Yes, yes. Did you okay, hear anything so, that I say said or No, I didn't say here I didn't hear anything you said and I just giving you a heads up, I don't think Audacity is, was picking me up. Well Audacity wasn't picking me up during that time. So I'm just saying if it happens again for whatever reason, I don't know what's going on on my end, just talk like normal. Okay, I guess we'll just have to brute force our way through this. Yeah, exactly. We're doing uh, it the Mike and Soli way. Yeah. Put that thing back where it came from. Or so help me, so help me. And cut. Yeah. Uh, can I? <laughs> should I repeat what I was saying now, or what do you yeah, think? Go ahead, go ahead. 
I was going to say, like, Team Rocket, the motto that the, the Jesse and James recite is different from the one Butch and Cassidy recite. So right. It yeah, they, seemed, they, they... So it kind of sounds wow. like maybe they were like, like, Jesse and James don't know what they're doing for Team Rocket or something. Well, I mean... Like, it might be on some that, heroes that who are fighting for the wrong side. Uh, I, I mean... Is that or they're just morons? No, they are morons, but I mean, like, they were tricked. <laughs> it's it's like when people say Anakin was tricked into joining the dark side. He wasn't, you know? He wasn't tricked. He was seduced. Uh, no, no, I... Difference there. No, that, that's what... That's what the movie is established, but people have joked about, like... Yeah, I... And being tricked. But anyway, uh... What are we going to talk about for the rest of this part? Oh. Uh, we've already talked about Pokemon. That's what Dr. Milk and I usually do when we're out of ideas. And we've already talked about that. So what the fuck do we do now? This game I mean, has good music, for... by the way. What is that? I was going to say the mo this game has good music. Well, yeah, of course. We have to mute it, though, for the commentary. Yeah. What were you going to say? I mean, we well, we could talk about Persona 4. I was playing that all, all night last night. Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about unless unless you're talking about the girls dating you and then beating you up. That's all well, I know no, about they it. Have, they have not beaten me up because I am faithful and choose only one. Yeah, that's usually. Uh, that, usually. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Oh, man, no. Last night, though, on Persona 4, okay, I just, I, I'm not going to spoil it, just in case anybody, you know, that's watching is going to play it, but holy cow, I got to December 3rd, and it, it, my heart went through, like, a, a freaking, uh, like, a press there, like, it, it squeezed my heart, ripped it out, put it back in, I was emotionally drained. Oh, man. I'm just, all I'll say, should, there's uh... a character that dies in front of you. What are we going to talk about for the rest of this part? Uh, are you still there? I can't. Oh. Uh, I guess I got to. I guess I got to talk about something while Tyler's not here. Uh, this is going to be a bitch to edit. Um like insane because there you are where have you been yeah oh, yeah there you are there you are no, same thing happened again uh yeah it, it started uh, did it freeze like right after i said a uh, character died in front of me no i i don't think i heard that part but oh okay well what i was uh, all i said was that in persona 4 last night I, I i get you get to a point and then a character that you love just dies right in front of you we should uh and then and then they get better <laughs> Don't you just love um, it when the dramatic tension is destroyed by the fact that the character gets better from dying? And, and no, honestly, in this case, it, 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 it wasn't. Like, this is the case where it's done well. Oh, okay. Like, holy cow, the character just, like, it's, like, they die on the metal, like, on, a, on the hospital bed. Oh, dear. And, oh, yeah. And then you have to confront the person, the, uh, the person that kidnapped this person. Oh, and you dear. have the option of killing the person. I didn't. No, you and then should you find have out killed them. You should have Then you find out... No, 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 no. You get the, you get the bad ending. And also... Well, I, I don't want to spoil it, but I'm just saying... It, it, you, you think one thing, but you actually find out something else that puts everything in a completely different light. This is The, the story is pretty complex in this one. Why are... Why is Persona so complicated? I thought it was. I thought you were supposed to just um, bang all the chicks the, or something. I thought I was the object of the game was to have his sex with as many girls as possible in an anime setting. Damn, are you gone again? Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Uh. This is a. Uh, I think I could hear when he cut out to, uh, we might have to record part 14 on a different day. Uh, 
Um, what can I talk about while I'm by myself? Pokemon, uh... These fling shots, man. I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh... This kind of reminds me of, uh, the final level in Sonic R. For the... Well... Hey, it fixed itself. There you are. I was talking about Sonic R. Ah, uh, yeah. The cavern kind of reminds me of the last level, Radiant Emerald. Oh, yeah. No. Uh, yeah. It really does. It does look like that. Yeah, it does. It, it, it's kind of weird. Um, we should, uh... We should probably record part 14 on a different day, because I don't think this is going to work out too well. <laughs> probably. Yeah, this is a little We better weird. not do two parts in a row like this. Oh, uh, no. Hopefully everything will come out fine for this part. At least good enough. That That's the motto. That, that, that's the motto of the show. <laughs> Start us gadget. So, good enough. <laughs> no, um... I hope I, I hope you I hope we save the audio because like I'm worried we're gonna get like I'm worried it's gonna corrupt at the end or something. <laughs> I'm gonna have to record something <laughs> completely different for tomorrow. Okay, oh, I, I mean the audio position thing it, it seems to be right, but I think the I think some of what I've been saying has been cut off at times. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. Um, I'll, so. I'll figure. I'll find out when I get to editing this. Man, it would—it's gonna sound probably very odd. Yeah, it probably will. Uh, so we're going to the sugar shack now to Ooh, get some. Yeah. I, I don't under. I—I've never heard a human being do that. that I knew of like I've only seen it on like TV and shit doing that. Well, I hear it all the time. Hannibal Lecter style. Uh, are you gone again? Myself. Well, that was a way to fucking get gone. <laughs> I'm scared now. So, uh, this is, um... Since we've worked in Silence of the Lambs, uh, fucking, uh... iCarly, there was a, uh... No, it was, it was the spinoff to iCarly. It was the next show, it was Sam and Cat. Hashtag Super Psycho. I don't know why the fuck they had references to uh, Silence of the Lambs in that movie. But, uh, yeah. whatever. Doesn't matter. Um, we're getting close to the end of the Silver Metal playthrough. Uh, I think, I think Ariana Grande's character in that show, like, Ariana's trying way too hard to make her sound dumb, like, visual, vocally or whatever. The <laughs> YII. It's, uh, it's not really that funny. I'm just exaggerating. I'm, I'm not even exaggerating. It's, like, pretty bad. So, uh, we made it to graduation. Thank fuck. Oh, the second graduation. I'm sorry. This is, like, middle school. And then we're gonna go to high school graduation in the next part. Um... You can see all there, since Tyler, uh, Tyler's don dead now. Oh, well, um... Oh, boy. This is gonna be hard to get the last part recorded. See everybody!